guys, it's Elizabeth. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we have another Stitch Fix box. So I feel like I just filmed a Stitch Fix box, um, but two things. First, I decided to do their like annual, what do you call it, style pass for $49, I think. And so with that pass, instead of paying $21 a box or however, 20, $21 a box, you pay $49 a year and you can get as many boxes as you want. And so I didn't historically do that, but I decided I wanted to. And so why not get more boxes, you know? And then also I got a box earlier than normal because I am going on a trip in a couple of weeks and I will be gone for quite some time. So I wanted to make sure I got this box on my channel this month. If you don't know what Stitch Fix is, it is a clothing subscription box. And for a $20 styling fee, you are gonna get five pieces of clothing. So it could be pants, shoes, tops, jackets, accessories, purses, the whole thing. And they're gonna to try to style some looks for you as well. So when you sign up, you do fill out a profile that asks you about your sizing, different sort of pieces you like or don't like, different areas of your body you're looking to accentuate, are you more of a going out style or workplace style or do you want loungewear? Just general questions like that. And then you can get the box as frequently as every two weeks or you can get it as infrequently as like once a year. It's entirely up to you. Um, and now when you choose to get your box shipped to you, your stylist will pick out some items based off of your profile and shoot you an email. In that email, you're gonna get about 10, 12 different items and you can go through all of those items and choose to either add it to your box or you could say, no, I don't like that or no, I've already got that. And then whatever is left over, your stylist will just fill up your box. Then it ships to you. You get three days to check out um, and you can just mail back the items you don't want. You can extend um, how long you get to check out. So I did, I was supposed to check out on Friday, today's Saturday, I clicked the little extend button and now I don't have to send my stuff back until Monday. So you do get a little bit of leeway here and there. When you get your box, it looks like this. And then inside of your box, you're gonna have your bundle. Everybody loves the bundle. And you're gonna have your return envelope. So it's a priority mail envelope that's already got a label on it for you. Anything you don't want out of your box or if you need to exchange something, you put it in here. I shove it in my mailbox. I do my best to get it in my mailbox and then I have the mailman take it. Um, you're also going to get a little packet and each packet has um, this green sheet, which is going to be the itemized list of all of the items that you got in your box, total pricing, etc. And then you're gonna get this other packet, which is, it's got like a note from your stylist and then all the different ways you can style the pieces that are in your box. So this is fix number 20 for me. And I have had my stylist Chelsea for quite some time. I think she does a great job. I've only had a couple of boxes where I haven't bought anything and that's very rare. So she tries really hard to put stuff in my boxes that I like and want to buy. So if you don't like your stylist, you can always change them. Now that $20 styling fee, if you do purchase an item out of your box that does get credited off of that item. And then of course you get, you know, a buy, buy all five discount where they'll give you an extra, I think it's 25% off. Let me check. Yes, if you buy all five pieces in your box, you do get an extra 25% off. Um, now, with the style pass, for the annual style pass, it's $49. You don't get that $20 styling fee every box. You're just gonna get your $49 off of one item. So you win some, you lose some there with that. All right, let's dive in. Before I open this up, I just wanna say thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch my video. It means the world to me. If you like this one, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you wanna see more of me, feel free to hit subscribe. I really enjoy filming these clothing videos. I feel like I have a lot of nice ladies that comment on my stuff. They're like five out of five box and it's just so positive, I love it. These are my favorite to film, quite honestly. All right, so 
The first item we got in our box is by Free People Movement by Free People. And it is the Inspire Cotton Crop Tea in the color, I'm interesting. The color on my sheet here says beige, and then the color on the tag says gray. And this is a, it costs $38. I was gonna say a $38 value. <laughs> I do have some ladies that have asked me for my measurements and the sizing of all of the items. Um, I am comfortable giving my measurements. I'm not gonna give like my weight or anything like that because weight is irrelevant. Um, but I will, I'll start telling you guys all my sizing for the, the videos. So I generally wear a small, um, unless I know that something runs small top wise. Um, I have larger breasts than most people. Um, so my measurements there are 32 double D. And then as far as other measurements, like I don't know the length of my torso or the around my arms. I'm not that in depth, but I generally wear a small, unless I know something runs small and then I'll buy a medium. So this is that top. It, this is more of a baggier fit top, so it looks to me at least. And it's cropped, just your generic t-shirt. I don't know how badly I want to spend $38 on a crop top, but it's cute. All right, the next item is, it's all tangled up. The next item is by Nine Britain, and it's the Jennifer Knit Wrap Dress in the color Mint, and this is $54. I also got this in a size small. So I am five foot two on a good day, and I normally order a small dress-wise, just because I don't want I don't like things to be too too long for me. When it comes to like a midi dress or like a crop dress or something like that, I still order a size small depending on how tight it looks in the picture. I will size up to a medium if I need to. So we got this in a small. And it's just a cute little V-neck wrap style dress. Looking at this dress this is gonna hit me right at the knee or maybe just a smidge above the knee. It's got some cute sleeves. They're like very flowy. And then is the wrap a full wrap? It is. So there is actually a slit in the dress. So super cute. This is really soft. It's a soft fabric. I've never tried on a green dress like this. So we're looking forward to it. The next item I got, oh, I, I'm sure I picked this for myself. This is by Market and Spruce, and it's the Kalen Brushed Knit Hoodie in the color dark gray. And this is $42, and I also got a size small. The length of my arms, we didn't talk about that. I have really short arms. I almost always cuff stuff, so. Not that that certainly applies to like a sweatshirt, but sweaters, yeah. I really like the Market and Spruce items. I think that they are super soft. They hold up really well through the wash and they're pretty fairly priced. So, <coughs> excuse me. This is just your nice like knit type hoodie. Does it have a pocket? It does have a center pocket right here that's like hidden. So we got sleeve wise super soft and it's more of like a scoop um, hem at the bottom. We do have a hood, super cute. I actually really like this and I don't have a striped hoodie. All right, the next item, I picked this for my box too, I was super excited. This is by Vero Moda and it's the Carson Knit Jacket in dark pink I also got a small in this, and this is $68. So I like the color pink, but I don't, I don't wear a ton of the color pink, if that makes sense. But I do have a Vero Moda jacket, very similar to this. It's probably this exact same thing, but it's like 
um, maybe plaid a little bit. It's in, I got it from another hmm, Stitch Fix box or maybe my Nordstrom box. Whatever box I got it out of, I'll link it up here. If it was the Nordstrom box, they don't make that box anymore. So just buyer beware with that. Um, but <clears throat> I was super excited about this. This is like a nice like springtime coat that I could wear to work. I work in an office and sometimes, I never know, it's an old building, so I don't know if it's gonna be like really hot one day, really cold. Um, and this just gives me so much spring vibes. It does have buttons and it's got pockets, super cute. I'm excited for that. And I feel like that, oops, I feel like that's a pretty decent price, $68 for, it's basically a coat. All right, last but not least, we got, these are by MPG Sport and they're the em Embrace Cropped Jogger in black. And I also got a size small in these and they're $55. So pants wise, um, I normally wear, what size pants do I wear? 25, 26 for the waist. Um, I, I do have larger thighs than normal for my body build. Um, so I'm generally trying to accommodate my legs with the size of my pants. <laughs> and then I almost always look for stuff that's cropped or petite just because of how short I am. When it comes to like stretchy things like yoga pants and stuff, I always wear a size small. Um, oh, I was wondering about these. I was like, I don't need a pair of cropped yoga pants. These are joggers. So this is what those look like up at the waist, super stretch. And then they do kind of stay straight legged all the way until the jogger part down here. And they've got a pocket. This is what the back looks like. Basically the same as the front. I'm actually excited for these. I've never tried, I don't have like the athletic style joggers, if that makes sense. Like I've got joggers from Airy, like the pajama ones or the sweatpants style ones, but I don't have any that are like the athletic material. So I'm pretty excited to try these on um, and see what they look like. All right, we are going to move on to the try on portion of this video. Okay, so the first item I have on was by Nine Britain and it's the Jennifer Knit Wrap Dress in the color mint. Once again, this was a size small and it is $54. So initial impressions, um, this is a little bit too revealing for me up top. Um, if I were to wear this, I would actually like pin it shut um, to keep it more like this, just, just me. Um, but it is a true wrap dress. So when I put it on, I literally like put it on like a vest and then you tie it over here on the inside and then tie it again over here on the outside. It is extremely comfortable. This is like nice and soft material. The only thing is, like I said, I would just personally pin this together. This is what the back looks like. And then I was right in saying that it would hit me like just above the knee. So this is a shorter dress and it does, I would wear some Spanx because it does have like the potential to blow significantly open. But this would be super cute for like a bridal shower, baby shower, church. M might be a little bit too revealing up top for church unless you pin it shut or wear like a cami or something. Um, same thing for like work, but just a nice spring vibes top, super cute. Next, I'm gonna pop on the all of that kind of athletic-y wear stuff and then we'll finish up with the jacket. All right, I put on the Free People Movement by Free People Inspire Cotton, it's cut off. It's the cropped tee in the color beige. Once again, I got a size small in this um, and it was $38. Down below, I also have the joggers on. Those were the MPG Sport Embrace Crop Jogger in black. Got a size small in this too um, and these are $55. You guys, you best know what I'm spending my $49 styling fee on. It's gonna be this outfit. This is awesome. So this is the crop top. It does have like a longer short sleeve, 
but I actually really like this. This is like comfortable to me. I enjoy stuff that's like, we can move in here. Like you wanna clean your house? You clean your house. You need to go to the, the store? Pop over the store. Um, it's just super great. So it's very plain and it's not super cropped either. I think with maybe the length of my torso, this hits me like right at where my pants line sits. So if I go like this, it's cropped, but otherwise, no. So this is a perfect Elizabeth top. And then super plain in the back, just cute all around. And then now for those pants, those pants, they are cropped joggers, but height wise, once again, I'm five foot two on a good day, a little smidge shorter than that. Um, these fit me perfectly. They're not cropped whatsoever and it's perfect. Okay, so here's those pants. And you can see they, they stretch. There's quite a bit of leeway pants wise in the waist here. Here's the pockets. And then they are cropped down here. The back. Super cute. I just, I love this whole fit. I'm gonna pop on that hoodie really quick and show you what that looks like. Um, I thought about putting that on first, but then I didn't wanna to have to worry about ripping it off, so. And this was the Market and Spruce knit hoodie. Would I wear it necessarily with this top? No, I wouldn't just because of how tight or how tight the arms are. You can see my sleeve like is all bunched up in there. What do we got going on here? And then of course, you know, the neck but this was that market and spruce Callen brushed knit hoodie in dark gray size small again and this was $42 so this is how far this comes down and see how I mentioned it has that like scoop knit hem where it comes up a little bit higher on the sides it does have this pocket here I do actually like to tie these from time to time, um, depending on what I've got on underneath it. Here's the sleeve. It's got a nice like jogger style sleeve. Super soft. This is a soft hoodie. Let's put the hood on just for the show. There you go. Super cute. I might buy this too. Do I need it? I need it like I need a hole in my head, but I love a good hoodie and I love market and spruce items. They're some of my favorite. All right, we're gonna wrap up with that coat and then I'll kind of let you know my final thoughts. Okay, so I brought out the other Vero Moda similar type coat that I have. Um, but once again, this pink thing, it's by Vero Moda and it's the Carson Knit Jacket in dark pink. I got a size small and this is $68. I'm about to spend so much money on this box because I need this coat. So I just put it on with a regular tight knit like long sleeve. And it was a little bit challenging to get on just because it was a long sleeve and this is like knit. It's kind of like trying to put yoga pants on after you put lotion on. This is hurting me. So this is what it looks like up top. This is that very similar type coat that I have. So also by Veramoda, but just plaid. The neckline's a little bit different. Like I like that this one is more like a coat or a blazer, whereas this guy is just it's just like a plain fold over type thing. Anyway, like I said, I'll link that box up above. Just be mindful it's the Nordstrom one. That box doesn't exist anymore. I'm sure you could still buy it, that jacket on their website. But then backing up, here is the length of the coat. These are just some black jeans that I already had, but it comes down a good, a good ways. We've got some nice pockets super like professional you could wear this in an office it does button i never button the other one that i have so i probably won't button this one either um but you could easily go outside super springy i feel good about this coat here's where i was talking about the length of the sleeves so they are a bit long just for my arm length um but i thought this was great so to kind of wrap up this box, remember we got this thing. I really do like this. I'm gonna ponder this 
for the day probably and see if I want to buy it. Do I need it? No. Do I want it? Yeah. And I'm supposed to be saving money. And then we got that Free People top, the cropped top. This I am going to get. And then we got the pair of joggers. These I'm going to get too. They fit me perfectly lengthwise. So that's the main reason behind getting those. We also got the Market and Spruce hoodie. This guy I'm going to pass on. I need another hoodie. Like I need a hole in the head. So we're just going to skip. It's super great though. I would, if you are in need of a hoodie, a, it's a thinner hoodie. It's definitely not a thick boy. Um, Market and Spruce. Great. And then last but not least, we did get this wrap dress. I'm going to pass on this cleavage wise. It was too much for me. I don't need another dress. I do think that this is super cute though. Very much spring vibes as well. Um, it's just not for me. So if you'd like to try Stitch Fix, I will pop my referral link down below. I do believe you get your first styling fee. So that $20 waived, but you also get to apply it to an item that you like out of your box. So it's kind of like free money. Um, and with that, I'll see you guys next time.